Uh, welcome back to the channel. So today uh, I'm going to have at the end of the video a uh, more detailed settings video and kind of talking about some settings that a lot of people want to know about plus some some of my peripherals and like DPI and all that in more detail. Uh, I'm going to leave this section at the end of the video after the clips play. Um, so enjoy the video. Make sure to stay all the way to the end uh leave a like subscribe and i'll catch you in the next one peace Mira, tiene hacker. El diablo tiene hacker. Ah, oh, someone get this guy. Movement demon, man. This is not a bot lobby. It is. He is probably the, the hardest person I've come across since playing COD. Toying with me. Anywhere where I don't die. No man, you're right, right. Come on. Okay, okay. okay. okay.
le mec. Il est où Il est où Vas-y. Il est où Il est où Regarde sur le terrain. Pas sur le terrain. Non. Euh, sur, sur le terrain. Vas-y. Accroupis-toi, Il n'y en a pas de comme moi. Là. Oh putain. Enemy soldier incoming. Alan, pas rien, Alan. Non, non, non. Ah, ben là, quel est le Oh, t'en as fait un peu de temps, là, 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 Probably, I hope so not, that you skipped at the end of the video to see the settings. So I'm gonna go over a brief uh, like a section of uh, my basic settings for keyboard and mouse, what people should change for better movement, and some of my peripherals, like uh, like the settings and what I use. So first of all, get the peripherals out of the way. I use my mouse right now, my main mouse is the Beast X from WL Mouse. I have a Wooding 60HE since it's like the best keyboard even though you don't need the best keyboard for Warzone because it doesn't have anything complex like Apex and Valorant and all that. Uh, quick disclaimer, this is future me. I'm editing the video and I, s I saw that I forgot to say what mousepad I have. The mousepad I'm using right now is a Skypad 3.0. Uh, I'm waiting on a, on a new one, a Skypad 4.0, like they rebranded the wall hack. But yeah, this is a Skypad 3.0, this is a glass pad. Also, I use dot skates for my mouse. Other than that, continue to the video. So my settings for keyboard and mouse, no controller, keyboard and mouse. I want 1600 DPI. I'm going to show in the software result. I want 1600 DPI and four sensitivity. I've been on this sensitivity for like two years. Um, my ADS sensitivity type is always legacy. It just feels more consistent for me. I know a lot of people play with coefficients and some config files, but I just feel with legacy and since the start of like MW2, I'm always on this sense. Um, something else, a lot of people ask me, uh, oh, how do you like, um, how do you like switch your weapons or like, why, how do you, why, why? Um, I just do my scroll wheel up and down, up and down. And you just need to change from mouse calibration, you need to change your mouse wheel delay to around like 65, 60, 70, it depends on your mouse wheel. I just have it at 65 and it just works wonders. You don't need to spam it. Uh, other than that, keybinds, uh, something unique, not unique, that what I use and I find it really nice, since I tilt my keyboard, I like hitting shift for my slide and like shift space, shift space. I don't like having uh, C or something else as uh, slide. I just like hitting shift with my pinky. Uh, I crouch with C and control is my sprint button even though I only use it when I want want to snake. Uh, you know, like snaking up and down. Other than that, I recommend highly you use auto attack spin since it's not really like complex and Warzone is just move forward with W. Um, other than that, I'm just gonna skim through these real quick and then i'm gonna skip to the softwares
Okay, now for the settings. Since uh, first of all, I use the Wing 60HE. This is the software. This is the color. Color doesn't really mind. Uh, performance. Uh, you need tachyon mode since it's like the fastest. Like the, it's minus one. Like it's the fastest and best delay you can get. The only bad thing is that you don't have as bright of lights, which is good for gaming, in my opinion. It doesn't distract you. Rapid trigger. Rapid trigger is like you can click, so you don't need to bottom out a switch to re-click it again. So you just you can just spam something, but this is not very useful for Warzone. I just have it just for the sake of having it. This is sensitivity. You just change the rapid sens trigger sensitivity. I just have it at the lowest. Uh, other than that, I don't have anything in remap or performance or anything. Now I'm gonna show you my my mouse settings. As I said, I'm using the WL mouse Beast X. Uh, in advanced, I have two different DPI tiers, which you don't really need. It's just 1600 DPI. Anything from 1600, 3200, even 6400 is the best for like accurate mouse sensors. But 1600 DPI is like the best since in-game menu takes from the Windows sensitivity because if you have like 3200 you probably need to lower the sensitivity from your windows it's just complicated i just like 1600 because like it's in the middle and the sensor is actually accurate um other than that lift off distance is one millimeter so where, when i can like flick and move my mouse and it's still accurate polling rate i use a thousand hertz because warzone and my monitor is not high hertz so it's not worth using extra battery just for no benefit but you have a high monitor and like a good performing pc 2k hertz or even 4k hertz is it's good like you can try it uh other than that no macros uh this is a view screen it's nothing to do that's basically all my settings hope you enjoyed leave a like uh and let me know if you want a more detailed like a movement guide since rebirth is out i can make like a lot since there's a lot of texts that people still ask and are curious about how we do. Other than that, see you in the next one.